Punctuation Marks Punctuation marks are signs that are used in sentences to make the meaning clear. Period or full stop You put a period or full stop at the end of a sentence. For example, John is my good friend. Please don't be late. Comma A comma is used between nouns and words in a list. A comma is also used after yes, and no, and before please, in sentences. For example, He bought two apples, four oranges, and some grapes. Yes, you can do it. Exclamation point An exclamation point is often used after a command, an interruption, or a word that expresses a very strong feeling. For example, Sit down. What a surprise. Question mark. Use a question mark after a question. For example, What's your name? Where do you want to go? Apostrophe. Use an apostrophe with an S to show who owns something. For example, We all like mom's cooking. I took a ride in Peter's car. Quotation marks Quotation marks are for when you want to use someone else's words or statements in your writing. For example, He said, I don't care about you. Tyrion said it is hard to put a leash on a dog once you have put a crown on his head. Colon A colon is used to give emphasis, introduce dialogue, present text, and make composition titles clear. For example, When you play the Game of Thrones, Either you win or die. There are two options at this time, run away or fight. Semicolon A semicolon is used to make the gap between two similar sentences smaller. For example, John likes meat, Jenny does not. The dog slept through the storm, the puppy cowered under the bed. Parentheses or brackets Parentheses or brackets are used to enclose related or additional information. For example, He lives in Berlin, the capital of Germany. I really miss seeing Emilia, my best friend. Ellipsis An ellipsis is used to indicate the omission of words or suggest an incomplete thought. For example, I know he deserved it but I was um, missing you today. Hyphen. Use a hyphen to connect words or word elements. It is also used to separate syllables of a single word. For example, This two-hour journey is finally over. This behavior is really destroying my self-esteem. And dash. An N dash is typically used to express ranges, period of time, or to clarify more complex compound words. For example, 
She lived in Berlin from 1999 to 2002. Read this lesson from pages 16 to 20. M dash. It can be used to replace commas, parentheses, colons, and semicolons. This is a long dash that adds emphasis to a particular sentence and enhances the readability. For example, I could not wait to meet them, I had missed them so much. Please call my manager, Mrs. Marvel, on Tuesday. Slash a slash is often used to indicate the word or. For example, Dear Sir or Madam. A slash is often used in dates to separate days, months, and years. For example, He was born on 30-11-2007. A slash is also used to indicate per in measurements. For example, the speed limit is 120 kilometers per hour. <laughs>